What's up everyone? Welcome to a new video. I've got something great for us today. So this is actually a subscription box from my dude Aster World UK. Um, I believe his name is Aster. Could be wrong, um, but you know they, they, he's been great to me, um, helping me out with finding different items and whatnot. And he's actually got three different tiers for his subscription boxes that you can pick from different things. There's the Slifer Red, Raw Yellow, and the Obelisk Blue. This is the Obelisk Blue box. I'm really excited to see what we get in here. Um, I'm gonna go ahead and cut it open just to see what we got. And I'm actually really excited to start making videos again. I planned on making a bunch last week, but some of you may know um, I did end up getting COVID. Um, I am alive, thankfully, but it was, it was rough. You know, I still got some of the symptoms and, but I'm feeling a lot better. I mean, it could have been a lot worse. I'm very thankful that it wasn't worse than what it was. So, all right, almost done here. Um, so, wrapped up, blue box, Astro World. Let's see here, I don't know the best way to open this thing. He said it's gonna be epic. He said it was gonna be really cool. You know, I'm really excited. This is my first time doing it with them. And I'm really excited to see what we get. So I'm hoping I can get all of this on camera. Um, if not, I'm gonna tilt this up just a little bit so you guys can see. So we've actually got the whole box here, Aster's World and everything and a bunch of packs. So let's see what we got. This is actually really cool. You can tell he definitely put some time into this. Again, Aster's World. Um, I don't know if that's his name, but um, regardless, really cool guy been great help and everything so far. So this loose pack here um, was a referral. Um, I did refer someone and anybody, if you do end up signing up for this, you actually get a free pack anytime someone signs up based off of your recommendation. So it looks like I've actually got a lot of packs here. I'm gonna go ahead and move this box out of the way. So they are all wrapped up. Let's see, we've got one two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, twelve packs it looks like. So let's go ahead and get to opening these. Let's see what we get. You know, I love variety like this where it's just, you know, you don't exactly know what you're getting. Um, first one, Hidden Summoners. And I'm sure there's a lot of packs in here that I've probably never opened just because I'm getting back into it here recently, but I've been loving it so far. Um, if you guys don't already follow me on Instagram, you really should. I'm putting a lot of cool content out there right now. Um, that's where I did start. I got Rising Rampage. I believe that is the one that you can possibly get um, Appalosa from. So that is exciting. But again, we got Dragons of Legend 2. If you guys aren't following me on Instagram, give me a shout there. And of course, like the uh, video here and please subscribe. You know, you guys, um, with me just getting started, all the support really does help. And I hope you guys like my videos. Give me some feedback, drop a comment. Let me know how things are going. Anything you guys would like to see. We got an Extreme Victory. That Rise and Rampage was first edition, by the way. Hope you guys enjoy me opening these packs as much as I do. Um, I may do, I may go ahead and open most of these. Got a Genesis Impact. Lots of really cool collector's rares can be found on there. I'm gonna open up some of these off the camera just so it's a little bit easier and I can go through a little bit faster. Fist of Gadgets with that one, first edition. How do you guys feel about like mystery boxes, subscription boxes? Do you guys like them? Do you think it's a waste of money? Um, you know, most of this stuff is kind of a gamble, just a way to have fun. Uh, Destiny Soldiers, I don't think I've ever seen that one. That one's really cool. But yeah, you know, pretty much this whole thing of opening packs and collecting, well, I guess aside from collecting, got a circuit break, first edition. Um, it's really just kind of the thrill. You know, have fun opening packs, see what you may or may not get. Um, 
We got a Soul Fusion first edition. Coming down to the last few packs here. And we will open these. The video's not going too long, just about five minutes here. Got Infinity Chasers. Again, this box is from Astros World UK. I will link that page down below in this description. Um, Spirit Warriors. Man, I'm loving this variety. Like, no duplicates of any packs at all. Um, and he's actually got a lot of really cool stuff on his site. You can buy a ton of items from him. He's got another box, but for us here across the pond, ooh, Eternity Code, first edition. Um, shipping is a little steep, but you know, this subscription box, box I think this one was 50. Um, so really not that bad. You know, I think this was 13 packs I got. I can't really complain about that one at all. Um, got a lot of really good items in here, I believe. So let's see what we got here. So we got an Eternity Code, Spirit Warriors, Infinity Chasers, Soul Fusion, Circuit Break, Destiny Soldiers, Fist of the Gadgets, Genesis Impact, Extreme Victory, Dragons of Legends 2, Rising Rampage, Legendary Duelist Rage of Ra, let's see if we can get a Ghost, and a Hidden Summoners. So let's just go ahead and start from the top. We're gonna start with this Eternity Code here, see what we get. I'm excited, man. I haven't opened up any packs here in a little while. Uh, I'm feeling, un <coughs> excuse me, under the weather. It's really kind of put me down and just been laying around, not doing a whole lot. So, alrighty. Good breaker. Never opened this set before. Goldilocks Battle. Is that really what that says? <laughs> Ancient Warriors Ambitious Child Day. That's actually a really cool looking card. I don't know. I don't think you're supposed to get uh supers or guaranteed supers with that you know with and there's a little bit there's an older set so i don't think so so i'll take a super with that one next one here we're gonna go spirit warrior again i've got no clue what's in these packs um weather snowy canvas six shinobi legendary six samurai mizuho Six Samurai United, and a Six Samurai Fuma. Looks like this is all um, supers and then a secret towards the end. It's actually a really cool looking card. Oh, what happened to our music? Oh, there we go, and we're back. Infinity Chasers. Basilisk, Familiar of the Evil Eye, Witchcrafter, Magician's Right Hand, not the Left Hand, Phantom Fortress, I don't even know, Infant Track, River Stormer, okay. Got a wicked looking tank going on there, neat. Soul Fusion. So this one is, it looks like it's got a little bit more cards in it. The Agave Dragon, Crusadia Crawler, Dino Wrestler King T. Rextel, and Gravekeeper's Headman, and we actually got a super, Second of Expedition into Danger. I love the card art. I'm just a sucker for most of the card arts, like even some of the commons, like that one's cool. So I'm Great Falco, Revenge of the Normal. Circuit Break, First Edition. First the dish. Goki Headbat. Some of these names are crazy. Duck Dummy, like this one here. Amazon is Pet Liger, Crawler, Metalverse. Hey, we got an Ultra Rare. Trickstar Black Cat Bat. Again, names are crazy. I'll take a freaking Ultra Rare though, that's awesome. On the Spy. Especially from these packs that I don't think a super or above is guaranteed. I could be wrong. Uh, so I think that one was a rare plus a hollow. <clears throat> Vance Straw, Abyss Prop, Abyss Actor, a Funky Comedian, Dark Lord Asmodeus. That one's cool. And then we got another secret here Abyss Actor Superstar. She is the superstar. I like these packs where you get all hollows plus, you know, a secret towards the end. This might be another one, Fist of the Gadgets. 
I just the pack basically just melted. <laughs> Swamp cleric, green gadget, prohibit snake. Boot up, gear change, and fire fortress of Liang Peak. Cool looking background there. Kind of hard to see with <clears throat> that secret foiling, but really, really neat. Genesis Impact. I believe this is a more recent set, but it does actually have some really cool collector's rares in there. So let's see what we can get. And a lot of dry charm support. From what I hear, that's actually a really good set. A really good uh, deck to play. Vote. Magistus. Drytron Alpha Thuban. Drytron cards look really cool. I've got no clue what the prices of these are. Any big haters, of course, I'll uh, I'll include some information on there just to see what we get. I'm not really expecting anything too amazing. You know, it'd be cool to get something really valuable, but really just this thing is a monthly subscription box picked up again from Astro's World um, to give some variety. So it doesn't look like we had a hollow in this pack, um, but just the variety for, for one, for me, all for me, but also you guys um, to give you guys some cool stuff to look at to open because it's not always fun seeing the same packs get opened all the time. Um, I know for me, I like to have a little bit of a variety just to, you know, change it up a little bit. All right, so we got an aquarium set, another really cool looking card there. Tune briefcase, tune rollback, aqua actress, guppy, and the goddess bow. Jesus, look at that card. That is insane. I love secret rares um, that are fusion monsters. Like, I just think they have the best foiling. So we got Rising Rampage left, Legendary Duelist, and Hidden Summon. I'm going to save this one for last. Just because I would love to get an Appaloosa. That is my favorite card uh, in really all of Yu-Gi-Oh. Um, that is my waifu, yes. <laughs> I just, you know, beautiful card. Everything. Oh, we got a Thunder Dragon? Okay. Classic card there. Classic, classic card. Desynchro. Sub... Gaki, I don't even know, the Poisonous, Mayakashi, Prank Kids, Rocket Rad, and whoa, that is wild. What even is that name? Gasha, Dokuro, the Skeletal, Mayakashi. Konami does such a good job on some of these secret cards. Alrighty, never actually opened this one. I think I started opening packs and getting back into collecting like just after this set got pretty popular and kind of died off some. Amplifier, Mechlord, I have seen a lot of it, especially my boys, the Booster Box Bros. Jinzo, Mechlord Army of Grinnell, and Cyber Energy Shock. So no hollow there, but it's just one pack, you never know. So we're gonna end it with a Rising Rampage first edition. Can we get something epic? There's a lot of potential big hitters in this set, I know that much. Um, but especially that upper low set, there's a lot of starlights in here. So, let's see. Smorg, Bird of Protection, or Smorg. Ran Ryu, Marcin of Sea Star, Smorg, Bird of Beginning. We got a Berserker of Tens or something. I don't know what that is. Cool looking card though. Hey, we did get a Hollow though. Dream Mirror of Terror, so. No Apollosa, but we did get a Hollow. That is not guaranteed with these sets. So, all right guys, well that actually concludes all of the packs. Um, I didn't separate all the supers and stuff, but again, I'm gonna go through and you know pick out the ones that were pretty valuable um, just, to, just to see what we pulled. But I appreciate you guys. Again, um, that box was from Aster's World. You can follow him over at Instagram. Um, and that is their page. Um, let's see. Um, yeah, if you review them and everything, you do get the possibility of getting a discount and some free stuff. So really do appreciate that over there at Astor's World. Again, I'll link them in the description just so you guys can see and check them out yourselves. If you guys do end up signing up for any of the subscription boxes, if you send my name along with it, uh, you will actually get a free pack and I'll get a free pack too. So just again, just mention my name, Ryan or Cardbreaker GT to them over there at Astor's World and you'll get a free pack. So, but I appreciate you guys. Really looking forward to getting back, doing some videos, doing some openings. 
Got a lot of really cool stuff coming up. Be on the lookout for a booster box battle with no response Yu-Gi-Oh. That'll probably be my next video I've got uploaded. We're gonna be opening a Korean pack. You guys do not wanna miss this, I promise. It's gonna be epic. So I appreciate you guys. You have a nice day. This is Cardbreaker, out.